gratitude for earth. That can also be a grounding technique. I'm just going to give you those today in the interest of time. But we are working on those right now. So thank you guys for bringing that to consciousness. Has Lamar shown himself to a large group recently? Yes, he does all the time. Uh, not on this planet, although he is going to. Uh, he does make appearances all the time to individuals in small gatherings, but large gatherings, not yet, not for a long time. And he and Father and Elohim have been with us here today as well. Just I just want to publicly thank them for coming to class today. Um, even though we release group, remove fears, emotions, something may come up to remind us of it, and it comes back with a vengeance, do we simply work on it again and again? Yes, <laughs> it's coming back because it still hasn't cleared, and there's deeper layers. So you just need to ask the questions, why is that boomeranging back? Why hasn't it cleared? What other attachments are there that I need to clear? What am I not remembering that happened to me? What other emotions am I not seeing or hearing or feeling? What vibrations are there? So go back and ask those questions. It means it hasn't fully cleared and it keeps coming back. I still have memories of past probations that were very painful. I have memories of rapes and all kinds of stuff. And I'm still clearing that myself. But I do not get, I can talk to you about it without crying. I can have real emotion but not break down. I can actually acknowledge it happened and the heartache and emotion associated with it on a lot of those is completely gone. And then I have others that I haven't dealt with yet that surface as I clear out and I'm ready for that. And that's like that with any experience we have. The loss of a loved one, the death of a child, um, if we drowned in a probation before and she's, so we have she's a clear water. Down. Multiple places, multiple okay. probations. All right, I'm going to hold it right there, and we'll be back in a minute. Um, so, guys in the back for this, um, let's, Scott, you have another couple videos that you could do and play some music just to give me a few minutes while I clear back there. I want to be here for that last video that we do. And before we do the very last video, in between that, it's already the left of 430. Then, um, then I have the Becca Shea Awake that I want to wait. I want to play that right before we watch the last video. Does that make sense? Okay, so you can play whatever videos or music you want. You guys work that out between you, and I'm going to go change and be right back and clear some of this because I've got to take a break. I'm hurt pretty bad. Costume change. Okay. Woo! And then this gives you guys a chance to process, take notes, and work through some of your own pain, okay? Don't give her those questions. You haven't answered any of mine. <laughs> 